What's going on, YouTube fam? It's your boy Tony Two Times, and we back with another video, man. And tonight we're gonna talk about none other than Dipset, them boys from Harlem, New York. We're gonna do our segment, Who the Best Rapper from the Group. We're not gonna talk about Purple City Bird Gang, you feel me? We're gonna talk about Dipset. So we ain't gonna talk about Um Casa and all of them. We're gonna talk about Jim Jones, Hell Rail, Cameron, Jude Santana. Freaky Zeke, you feel me? J.R. Ryder, and that's where we're going to go with it. Now, let's take it back, man. Let's take it back to, like, 2003, 2002, when Cam had the whole hood wearing pink. Everybody was wearing pink, and he came out with a bold statement with the pink and the pink Range Rover and the Killer Cam video. And I just feel like these boys was really trendsetters. You know, Harlem always had that different kind of swag about them. You know what I mean? And when they came on the scene, it's like everybody just went crazy. Of course, Cam been out. You know, him and Mace came up together. But when they when these dudes came together, like when they found Santana and Jim Jones and all that, they made hits like Diplomatic Immunity, like one of my favorite CDs, you feel me? Like I still listen to that CD sometimes. You know, I'm just old school like that. But, man, when it come down to – who is the best rap out of the group? We got to break it down into a lot of different categories. Because we got Hell Rail. You know, he came with that gutter flow, them punch lines. You know, he had basically that project music. Then you got Santana. He had like that slick kind of style. You know what I mean? Kind of go at the women and all that. But then you got that boy Jim Jones, you know. Of course, he was speaking that blood talk. You know what I mean? He was coming from kind of like that project music too. You know, that trap boy music. But Cameron had, like, that arrogant, like, slick, like, kind of tongue, you feel me? Like, Cam say stuff, and you like, damn, how you get away with even rhyming that? But, man, my pick out this group, I'm going to have to give it to, damn, okay. I'm going to have to give it to, I want to say, mm, this is a hard one. Oh, man, I'm going to have to give it to Jim Jones. And the only reason I said that, because I seen Jim Jones go from not really being relevant. Like, he was relevant in the group always, but his growth and his CDs, like, that he released, like, after them and all that was definitely banks. And that's just my opinion. Y'all leave y'all comments below. Let me know what you think. If you're new to the fan, be sure to subscribe. Hit the notification bell for uploads. If you want to pledge or donate, check out the Patreon. Also, check out the links in the description. Love, fam. Huh?